With the number of people constantly moving here to our metro area, it's not just housing we need to worry about. The number of inmates at the Denver jail is also on the rise. Liz Gillardi looks at what's causing the overcrowding and what's being done about it. This is an early warning. As of today, 2,073 people housed in Denver jail facilities. That's after people were released this morning. During the first three months of this year, the number of inmates is trending up. We're higher than the last two years in both jails, uh, which uh, is of concern. Statistics tell the story. The sheriff's department wants to keep capacity under 92 percent. In March, only two days were below that magic number. When you look at both jails, Jails combined. When we hit 92% capacity, uh, it becomes uh, more challenging. A Denver Council committee heard those concerns and listened to recommendations, like getting help for the mentally ill to keep them out of jail, a focus on home detention, and other ways to free up space. One that they mentioned is open up another part of the you know, jail out at the county. I'm, you know, I'm not sure that's the great strategy. We hope we don't have to get into that overcapacity problem. In addition to the city's growing population, the department says a significant number of bookings so far this year came from other jurisdictions. Based upon our trending, uh, we're anticipating 2016 to be a tough year.